I don't have a lot, but I think the ones that I have are really interesting. So I'm going to start with fashion, and then go into makeup, and then just random favorites. So Merry Christmas Eve, guys. And as you can see, I'm dressed very festively because it's Christmas Eve, and I thought I would do a December favorite. Favorites are these ankle boots by Steve Madden. They are the Steve Madden Martai, Martai, right? Ankle boots, and I absolutely love these. They are 100% leather, and when I first got these, well, let's back up. I got these at Marshalls for about $70, which may seem a little high, but like I said, they are leather soles, and they're 100% leather. So for that price, I think it's really good, and I wear these all the time, and um, I really love these because they kind of they go with everything and you can really dress them up and dress them down and I recently got back from Vegas on Tuesday and I wore them I only bought this pair of shoes and a pair of chocolate um, shore Ugg boots so I think they're very versatile and they are so cute and following in the shoe, the shoe trend are my mini Tonka fringe boots and these are the calf high boots in brown the chestnut color I just looked it up on the internet but these are my mini Tonka calf high fringe um, boots and I love them I've had these for about a year maybe a little bit over almost a year I think I got them last December and they're still like brand new and I got these um, at urban and the next accessory I have I got on Black Friday it's my DNG new anchor steel rose gold watch and I absolutely love it and I'm usually wearing it. I'm not wearing it right now because it's in this video and I want to show you guys um, it's really pretty and I think it's got like a menswear look to it but I still really love it I think it's that boyfriend look mullet shirt and it's on the website this was this specific one's on the website but it's called the Maggie mullet and I think they still have them in store <coughs> wow <clears throat> I don't know what's wrong with me but yeah that's one of my favorite shirts. last fashion item is bag actually and you guys have seen this this is my Linnea Pell Dylan bag and I love it it's got gold hardware which you guys know I love and on the inside it's got this like brown and white zebra print which I didn't love at first but it's great and again it's 100% leather and I think the thing about leather that I love is most of them, if they're really good leather, they age really well and they just look better. Beauty products. The first of which, I don't know if this is a beauty product, but is my <coughs> Paul Mitchell, my Paul Mitchell Tea Tree Lemon Sage Thickening Shampoo. And I also have the conditioner, but it's like, it's got stuff on it, so I'm not going to show you guys. But it's this, and I got the big one with the pump, and they came actually in a set. Both of these are $40, which is really great. And I don't know if you guys could see that. But I'm only like right there, and I've had this for like six months. So Benefit Bad Girl Brown Mascara, and I really love this because on an like day to day, I don't wear really thick makeup, and I'm not even wearing makeup right now. But um, when I do, I like wearing brown uh, makeup unless I'm going out or like going to a special event. And I really like this because the brush or the applicator, it's not too thick. Uh, let's see if you guys can see that. It's not that thick, and I think it's really good, and it just makes, I think it just accentuates my eyelashes, and it doesn't weigh them down. My Basha Peppermint Blotting Linens, and I really like these, it just looks like that, like pretty normal, and I like these because when you use them on your face, it's like a cooling effect, and it's really great on those like spring, summer days where you don't want to carry another like blotting powder just use this benefits benetint benetint and I got this in like um, the Sephora lip sampler for for like um, a long time ago I have two of them but this is the older one and I absolutely love it because it just gives again accentuates my lips and I'm really into sort of like the natural look I don't really like looking like I wear makeup so this is great and it smells like roses Sonia Kashuk eyeliner palette called lay it on the line and it looks like that and it comes with okay if I can open it I will show you guys it comes with oh 
it comes with one, two, three, five different eyeliners. And this is the mirror that I haven't opened because I just used a different mirror and it comes with a little brush that I haven't opened. And it comes with a black, a brown, an army green, a purple, and a blue. And I don't know if I've swatched these for you, but I will swatch them for you. The blood, they're very pigmented. That's the black. That's the brown. This one's the brown. Hold on. You guys see that? This is the brown and this is the black. And my middle finger, my sorry, my ring finger is gonna be the army green. I think it's really pretty. And then my pinky is gonna be the purple, which I don't think is gonna show up on camera, but it's purple. And for my thumb, this is so awkward, is the blue. Thumbs up! Home Alone London Vitamin E Nourishing Hand Treatment. I don't know if you guys will be able to see that. Now this, it's 3.7 ounce, 3.4 ounce. It's a little pricey, but to me it's worth it because it's really, if you guys don't like really strong scents in a hand lotion and you don't like something that, you know, it's overpowering, um, this is a great investment and it smells, I don't know what it smells like. It just it's, it reminds me of something, but it smells really natural. The beauty item I have is a nail polish, and it's by Zoya, and it's in the shade ZP077 or Kate. Kate, and I love this because it's my perfect rose color, and yeah, I wear it all the time. Kind of random favorites. Um, my favorite song of the month is It Girl by Jason Derulo. Um, yeah, I don't know. I'll link a. Uh, like a YouTube video to it like down below but it's just a really catchy song but it's got a cute message so is Big Bang Theory it's hilarious it's nerdy and it's so great and also grim which is based on the grim fairy tales so good little and lemon thin little lemon crackers from like the 99 ranch you can get them there they're so so good um, they're very light Let's see if I can open it but anyway they look like that and they're delicious and it's inexpensive and they're satisfying. Drink of the month is Jasmine Tea, unsweetened. Um, you can get it at like, um, it's a grind, not it's a grind, is it a grind? No, it's Coffee Bean. I can get it at Pete's Coffee. Pete's Coffee is my favorite one if you're, you know, going to a cafe to get it. Um, but if you are going to a grocery store, I would recommend Tea's Tea. Jasmine, it's just Jasmine Tea. Jasmine Green Tea, actually, and it's so delicious and Oh, I just love it. Um, you guys are having a fantastic Christmas Eve, spending time with your family, friends, or boyfriends, or husbands, or whatever. If you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up, so I know that you guys like it with my little eyeliner. <laughs> Anyways, give it a thumbs up, and yeah, subscribe for more videos. I'll see you later.